Hello, my name is Belle Gerhard. I'm the recruiter here at Berger, and it's my pleasure to visit and talk with you about the Berger family of companies. As you may know, this year marks Berger's 110th anniversary. And today I would like to take you on a journey that began all the way back in 1910. Now it's time to meet a man who saw a tremendous opportunity years ago. His name is Carl Berger. With Minneapolis experiencing explosive growth in the early 1900s, Mr. Berger took advantage of this growth and founded Berger Transfer and Storage in the spring of 1910. Business assets at that time consisted of a single horse and cart that were used to move household goods from the Minneapolis train depot to the homes of new residents in the Twin Cities area. Then, in February of 1949, Mr. R.D. Dirks seized upon a great opportunity and purchased 50% ownership of Burger Transfer and Storage. Together, Mr. Burger and Mr. Dirks continued to grow the business and opened the first Burger branch location in Chicago, Illinois. By 1952, Mr. Dirks had purchased the remaining 50% and became sole owner of Burger Transfer and Storage. Shortly after, he moved the company into a 5,000 square foot warehouse located in Northeast Minneapolis. Also that year, Berger opened a second branch office in Sheboygan, Wisconsin. This served the furniture manufacturers of that area with new furniture delivery service into Minnesota, Iowa, and the Dakotas. In early 1960, Berger moved into its new headquarters on McAllister Drive in St. Anthony, Minnesota. After 50 years of business, Berger Assets consisted of four tractors, four straight trucks, and 12 trailers. Gross revenues were $330,000. In the fall of that year, Berger saw a new opportunity for growth and became an agent for Global Van Lines. In 1975, with an opportunity to align itself with the country's number one van line, Berger made the transition to become an agent of Allied Van Lines. This move enabled Berger to gain significant market share in household goods relocation. Also that year, Berger purchased the assets of Cook's Moving in Dallas, Texas, and branded the new location Berger Dallas. In 1985, as the 3M national account business afforded us more opportunity, Berger responded to the increased volume by opening its second Texas branch in Austin. Berger continued its nationwide expansion by opening the first West Coast branch in the Los Angeles area of California in 1993. Also that year, Berger established Relocation Today, a full-service relocation company. In 1999, Berger purchased the Houston location from McClatchy Movers. With the addition of the Houston office, Berger had three branches operating in the state of Texas. In 2001, Berger took advantage of a huge opportunity and experienced explosive growth with the acquisition of eight new locations. Purchased from fellow Allied agent MP Movers, Atlanta, Charlotte, Cleveland, Cincinnati, Columbus, Kansas City, St. Louis, and Louisville joined the Berger ranks. Berger also gained two individuals that went on to become Berger Network Managers, Brian D'Antonio and Randy Underwood. 2001 was also the year Berger established Logix Transportation. In 2005, Berger gained its fourth Texas location with the opening of Berger San Antonio. Three years later, Berger continued to expand into the Southwest with the opening of Berger Phoenix. Berger Tampa followed with the 2010 acquisition of Cook Moving System. And finally, in 2014, Berger purchased its newest branch in Las Vegas. The Beyond Distribution Authority was also established to help grow and diversify the wide variety of services that we offer today. As we celebrate 110 years of service, Berger has grown into a premier household goods moving and distribution company with 16 nationwide locations, over 400 employees, hundreds of owner operators, and annual revenues in excess of $140 million. Today, Burger continues to be owned and operated by the Dirks family and has grown to become one of Allied Van Line's largest 
asset-based partner agents. From a single horse and cart in 1910 to a nationwide full-service moving company today, we think Carl Berger would be very proud of what he started. <laughs>